When shipped ashore, gantry crane unloads containers from the vessel. Yard crane is ready to receive it from the gantry crane to move to the yard. Rubber-tired gantry crane, which is called RTGC, is a typical type of yard crane and widely used throughout the world, as it moves freely in a terminal. This type of crane has been continuously evolved to meet the customer's needs and requirements. The first generation of RTGC is equipped with diesel engine for a power source, which enables the crane to move in a terminal without physical limitation. The disadvantages for this type are high fuel cost and pollutant. A terminal should be burdened with approximately $213,000 per year, plus 454 tons of CO2 per year. Second generation of RTGC has came up with cable reel system to solve this problem. Container terminal could considerably save fuel cost and reduce contaminants thanks to this development. However, more RTGC should have been installed at the yard to overcome movement constraints of this type due to cable-connected power supply system. Hyundai Samho Heavy Industry has developed wireless power transmission system to RTGC for the first time in the world as a solution for the problems which the first and second generation RTGC have. Development of third generation RTGC will satisfy customers' requirements such as reinforcement of environmental regulation, low energy consumption, and greater mobility. Wireless power transmission system was developed by KAIST for the first time in the world. This system enables electric power over 100 kilowatts to be transferred from feeder line to a battery and a motor, which are installed on the crane. It is maximum 90% of efficiency comparing to the conventional cable reel type. Wireless power transmission system is able to provide high mobility. In addition, installation and maintenance cost will be dramatically reduced comparing to the conventional cable connected type by sharing a feeder line between other cranes nearby. A battery which will be installed to RTGC will store regenerative braking power, whereas cable reel type crane receives all electric power from a container yard substation. So, wireless power transmission system will reduce the required capacity of container yard transformer by more than 50%, consequently reducing electric charges of a terminal and the cost of electrical facility like transformer and switch gear. More economically more environmentally, more freely. With more than 40 years of experience in industrial crane field, Hyundai Samho Heavy Industrial will open a new era with continuous research and development for smart and green terminal.